Welcome to Ontario's first Diverging Diamond Interchange, or DDI, located at the QEW and Glendale Avenue Interchange. In this video, we will walk through the operation of this type of interchange. A Diverging Diamond Interchange has a number of benefits, including increasing safety through a reduction in the number of conflict points, reducing the possibility of collisions, maintaining efficient traffic flows, and has a compact footprint, using space more efficiently while still facilitating large volumes of traffic. These highlighted paths show how traffic traveling on the QEW is able to access north and southbound Glendale Avenue via the off-ramps. These highlighted paths show how Glendale Avenue traffic is able to access the east and westbound QEW via the on-ramps. For straight-through traffic on Glendale, these highlighted paths show the diverging lanes in action in which the lanes flip to the left side and back to the right side. This flyover is following Glendale Avenue northerly. The traffic shown is illustrating driver actions as the vehicles approach traffic signals and stop signs while using the interchange. This flyover is heading southbound, showcasing similar vehicle and pedestrian movements. The northbound vehicles have come to the traffic signal and are waiting to flip back to the right side. We are now following the QEW westbound off-ramp, where vehicles are guided to Glendale Avenue south and north by the left and right lane overhead signs. They then wait at the controlled stop signs for safe entry onto Glendale Avenue. Similar to the westbound off-ramp, the eastbound off-ramp provides access to Glendale Avenue north and south. However, the Glendale southbound from this direction is a dual right lane without a controlled stop. This free flow allows high traffic volume through the busy south side towards the Outlet Mall and Niagara College. This is the view from a driver's perspective as they drive northbound on Glendale through the interchange. In this scenario, the driver navigates the lane flip to the left side and then takes the QEW westbound ramp on the left. A southbound driver would have a very similar experience as this northbound driver did. This is the driver's perspective when taking the QEW Niagara-bound off-ramp to northbound Glendale Avenue. The overhead signs tell the driver which lane of the off-ramp will take them north or south. In this case, our driver is heading north, so they stay to the left. The driver waits at the stop sign for safe entry onto Glendale Avenue. Having a stop sign instead of a traffic signal allows the driver to merge onto Glendale Avenue in a shorter period of time. Pedestrians and cyclists can move through the DDI using the multi-use path, or MUP, along the center line of the bridge. This configuration provides more efficient alternative compared to having sidewalks and bicycle lanes in the more typical location along the sides of the bridge. The MUP on the bridge is protected by raised barriers. Tactile plates are present on either side of the crosswalk to alert people with low or no vision of the potential hazard, such as moving vehicular traffic. Audible push buttons are provided to allow pedestrians and cyclists to signal their intention to cross. Once pressed, a walk signal will be made available during the next cycle of the signals. Shared pathway signs and directional markings are designed to guide the public through the MUP.
We now shift to north of the QEW, where a new roundabout is constructed at the Glendale Avenue and York Road intersection. This roundabout provides flexibility at the intersection to accommodate traffic flow in all directions and is guided with islands to improve efficiency. The roundabout eliminates the need for traffic signals, which allows for efficient movement through the intersection. Roundabouts are also safer as they eliminate vehicle conflict points. The center of the roundabout provides an area for landscaping features. The MUP continues to the roundabout and pedestrian crossing is accommodated with marked crosswalks through the west and north legs of the roundabout. Here we can see the safety features of the roundabout in a first person view as a pedestrian. The signage to warn vehicles of pedestrian crossing is evident through give way signs and pavement markings. Pedestrians are warned of the crossing through tactile plates on the ground. As we approach the roundabout, traveling westerly along York Road, our first exit takes us north on Glendale Avenue, the second would continue along York Road, and finally the exit our vehicle takes is heading southbound on Glendale Avenue towards the DDI and QEW interchange. Thank you for watching the public education video of Ontario's first diverging diamond interchange. Made possible with support from the Ministry of Transportation, Niagara Region, the Brennan Morrison Hirschfield Design Build Team, and other participants of the project. For additional information, please visit qew-glendale-interchange.ca.